In this snip, we're going to look at integrating Trello with other services using if this, then that. For this demo, I'll be using Twitter as the other service. However, you'll find most services follow the same formula. So I'm already signed into Trello and I'm signed into Twitter. So I'll head over to if this, then that or ifttt.com. If you don't have an account, you'll need to create one first, and then when you're signed in, click on your username, and then choose Services. Scroll down and look at All Services, and then we'll look for Trello first. Click Connect, and you'll be asked to authenticate. As I'm already signed in, I just need to click Login and Allow. And then I can repeat this for Twitter. So look for all services, filter on Twitter, connect. And again, I'm already signed in, so I just need to authorize. Now I need to create an applet. So click on my applets, go new. And then I need to create my first condition. So I'm going to be looking for tweets on Twitter. It's going to be a new tweet from me with a specific hashtag, which will be TechSnips. I'll create the trigger, and then I need to choose what happens when that condition is met. This list is searchable as it was earlier, so I'll quickly find Trello, and the only option available is create a card. So I select which board, it knows which boards I have due to the integration between the two services, and I'll choose Twitter Notes. And then I need to specify which list name. Note that this doesn't auto-populate, and if you choose a list name that doesn't exist, they'll create it for you. However, I want this to go into my Reminders list, and I want any new tweets to show at the top of my list, so it will push old ones down. The title is going to be the text of the tweet without the hashtag, and I'm going to leave the description the same. It embeds the tweet, tells me who it was created by, and because of the nature of my condition, this will only ever show up as me, but I might expand this in the future. I'm not going to assign it to anyone. This could be used if you have a team board and you want to specifically assign incoming cards to a specific person. And there are ingredients to help point these at specific people dynamically. And then I'm going to leave the labels as they are. If you had specific labels you want to add, you can create them here. And again, you can use ingredients to customize this so it's not a static list. When you're happy, click Create Action. And then you get the summary of what your new if this then that applet is. So in this case, it's a new tweet by me with the hashtag TechSnips, and it will create a new Trello card. So I'm happy with that. I'll click Finish, and then head over to Twitter, compose a new tweet, and I'll tweet this out. If this then that actions aren't instant, so it could take a little while for this card to show up on my Trello board. And as you can see, my new card's been created. Notice that the tweet I sent out was, I'm recording a hashtag TechSnips video, but because I told if this then that to discard the hashtag, the card has just been titled, I'm recording a video. If I open up the card, I can see the attempt at an embedded tweet, and then the timestamp of it, and the service it came in on. So the formula for creating integrations between Trello and other services are generally the same as this. So that's been integrating Trello with other services using if this then that. Thank you for watching.